Hello. Module number one. In this module, we are going to study about the atomic number and mass number. To understand the atomic number and mass number, we must be able to define the atomic number. What is mass number? How we can calculate number of electrons, protons, and neutrons? What is the relative atomic mass and unit that is atomic mass unit? Observe this diagram. Oxygen, atomic number eight, mass number 15.999 minus 16. Symbol O, helium. Symbol H, -E, atomic number, miss number of proton is two, mass number four. Now, what is atomic number? Observe this diagram in which at the center nucleus where electron, proton, and neutrons are present. Around the nucleus, we observe electron. How we can define atomic number? The atomic number of an element is equal to the number of protons present inside the nucleus of its atom. It is represented by symbol Z. As all atoms of an element have the same number of protons in this nuclei, they have the same atomic number. Observe this diagram. Hydrogen having only one proton inside the nucleus. That's why atomic number is one. Oxygen symbol O. How we can calculate the atomic number? Observe the diagram. There's eight proton present inside the nucleus. That's why atomic number is eight. The atomic number is the number of protons. What is atomic number? How we can define? We can define atomic number. The total number of protons in the nucleus of an atom gives us the atomic number of that atom. It is represented with the letter Z. All the atoms of a particular element have the same number of protons and hence the same atomic number. Atoms of different elements have different atomic numbers. For example, all carbon atoms have the atomic number of six because they contain six protons inside the nucleus, whereas all atoms of oxygen have eight protons in their nucleus, means they having eight protons. Observe this diagram. Here represented first 20 elements atomic number, hydrogen atomic number one, having one electron inside the nucleus. Helium, atomic number two, having two electron inside the nucleus. Lithium, atomic number three, having three electron inside the nucleus. Beryllium, atomic number four. Boron, atomic number five. Carbon, atomic number six. Nitrogen, atomic number seven. Oxygen, atomic number eight, means eight electron Eight, eight neutron is a proton present inside the nucleus. Chlorine, atomic number nine. Nine proton present inside the nucleus. Neon, 10. Sodium, 11. Magnesium, 12. Aluminium, 13. Silicon, 14. Phosphorus, 15 electron present, proton present inside the nucleus. Sulfur, 16. Chlorine, 17. Argon, 18. Potassium, 19. Calcium, 20 means 20 proton present inside the nucleus of calcium atom. You must memorize these elements, their symbol, their name, and their atomic number. Atomic number is also represented the position of element in the periodic table, means number of proton. Now, what is mass number? The mass number is the sum of number of protons and neutrons present inside the nucleus of an atom. It is represented by the symbol A. Means A can be calculated with the help of atomic number plus number of neutron. Atomic number will be represented by Z, mass number will be represented by A, and number of neutron. If we add number of proton with number of neutron, we can obtain the mass number. Where N is the number of neutrons? Each protons and neutrons and has one AMU mass. Observe this diagram. Mass number is the number of protons and neutrons. 
hydrogen having only one proton. There's no neutron present inside the nucleus of hydrogen atom. That's why atomic mass, mass number of hydrogen is one. Oxygen. Observe the diagram. Inside the nucleus, we observe that eight protons as well as eight neutron. Some of proton and neutron will be 16. So atomic number of mass number of oxygen is 15.99 means 16 amu. How we can define mass number? What is the mass number? The number of protons and neutron combined to give us the mass number of an element. It is represented using the letter A. As both protons and neutrons are present in the nucleus of an atom, they are together called nucleons. For example, an atom of carbon has six protons and six neutrons. Thus, it is a mass number is 12. While the number of protons remains the same in all the atoms of an element, the number of neutrons can vary. Thus, the atom of the same element can have different mass number and these are called isotopes. Means isotopes are element having same atomic number but different in mass number. This difference is due to the number of neutrons. The weight of an electron is almost negligible. Thus the atomic mass of an atom is almost the same as its mass number. Here we presented first 20 element name, atomic number, and their mass number. Hydrogen, one proton, atomic number one. But no neutron, mass number one. Helium, atomic number two, means two proton, and mass number four, two proton, plus two neutron. Lithium, three atomic number, mass number seven. Beryllium, four and nine. Boron, five and 11. 11 means number five, number of proton, and remaining will be the neutron. Carbon, six proton and six neutron, mass number 12. Nitrogen, seven proton and seven neutron, mass number 14. Oxygen, eight proton, means eight proton and eight neutron, mass number 16. Chlorine, nine and 19. Neon, 10 and 20. Sodium, 11 proton and neutron will be 12, add them 23. Magnesium, 12 atomic number, mass number 24, means 12 proton as well as 12 neutron. Aluminium, 13 and 27, silicon, 14 and 28, phosphorus, 15 and 31, sulfur, 16 and 32, chlorine, 17 and 35.5, argon, 18 and 40, potassium, 19 and 39, calcium, 20 atomic number, means 20 proton, and mass number is 40, means 20 proton and 20 neutron. Okay? Memorize this. How we can calculate the number of neutron? It will be the number of neutron. How we can calculate? We can write the mass number minus atomic number. We can obtain the number of neutrons. You have to practice first 20 elements. So you are able to calculate or predict the number of neutrons easily. Now, number of protons and neutrons of, of some element. Atomic number 17, mass number 35. Proton will be same as the atomic number. And atomic mass number minus atomic number 35 minus 17, it means this element having 18 neutron inside the nucleus. Atomic number 11, mass number 23. Number of protons means same atomic number, means number of proton. Mass number minus atomic number, we can obtain number of neutron. 12 neutron present inside the nucleus. Atomic number six, carbon, mass number 12. How we can calculate number of proton? Atomic number same as number of proton. And mass number minus atomic number, we can obtain number of neutron. Atomic number 15, it's phosphorus, mass number 31. Atomic number will be same as the number of proton. Mass number minus atomic number, we can obtain number of neutron, that is 16. So, a student, number of neutron can easily be calculated with the help of mass number minus atomic number. What is relative atomic mass? The relative atomic mass
So we can define relative atomic mass of an element is the average mass of its atom compared to the 112th the mass of a carbon 12 atom. The relative atomic mass of organ of an element is calculated from the mass number of its isotope, the abundance of these isotope means percentage composition in the atmosphere. How we can calculate relative atomic mass? Relative atomic mass is scale. What is the relative atomic mass scale? Carbon 12 scale. Masses of atoms are expressed relative to, relative to the mass of carbon 12 atom. Observe this diagram. Why is there a need for the scale? Atoms are too small to be weighed directly. Inconvenient to express masses of an atom in terms of kg. So what does this, it imply? One atom, one atom of carbon 12 having mass 12 amu. So one upon 112, one divided by 112, the mass of carbon 12 atom is equal to one. So any electron or any neutron having the mass one amu. Note, relative atomic masses have no unit. It is dimensionless since they are relative to the arbitrary standard that is ratio. However, in more advanced texts, relative masses are represented in the terms of atomic mass unit, AMU. So here we are going to do practice how we can calculate relative atomic mass of chlorine. We, as you know, isotopes and relative atomic mass, they are interrelated to each other. You know, isotopes are the atoms of the same element that have different number of neutrons. Chlorine has two isotopes, chlorine 35 and chlorine 37. In chlorine 35, we, have, we, are, we observe that 18 neutrons, 17 protons and 17 electrons. And this chlorine atom present in the atmosphere as 75 percent. Chlorine 37, they having 20 neutrons inside the nucleus and 17 proton inside the nucleus. Mass number is 37. Atomic ion number of electron is 17. This type of chlorine, this isotope of chlorine is present 25 percent in the atmosphere. The relative atomic masses of an element is the average value for the isotopes of the element. It takes into account the percentage abundance of the isotope. So we can calculate relative atomic mass with the help of 75% of 35, chlorine 35 and 25% of chlorine 37. So, we can say atomic mass unit is a unit AMU relative atomic masses of some example. Sodium has relative atomic mass 23 AMU. Oxygen has relative atomic mass 16 AMU. And nitrogen has relative atomic mass 14 AMU. Atomic mass unit, the unit of relative atomic mass is called atomic mass unit. And symbol is AMU. It is all the letters in, represented in small letter. 1 AMU is equal to 1.66 into 10 to power minus 23 gram. Now, a hydrogen atom is 8.40% as massive as the standard carbon 12. Therefore, relative atomic mass of hydrogen can be calculated with the percentage of that is 8.40% in the atmosphere. We relate with the standard of carbon 12 atom. So we can obtain relative atomic mass of hydrogen is 1.008 AMU. Here we presented some common element and their relative atomic mass, hydrogen 1 AMU, nitrogen 14 AMU, oxygen 15.99 minus 16 AMU, sodium 22, means 0.989 minus 23 AMU, aluminium 
26.9 minus 27 AMU and sulfur 32 AMU, chlorine 35.45 minus 35.5 AMU and iron 55.84 minus 56 AMU. Hope you understand. Thank you.